Welcome to Board Briefs with Bridget. I'm the Communications and Marketing Coordinator for Richmond Community Schools. This meeting was the first work session of the RCS Board. The work session allows the Board to dive deeper into areas concerning education and student achievement at RCS. The second meeting of every month is still going to be a regular Board business meeting. The three topics of discussion for tonight's meeting was RHS synchronous instruction experience, K through 12 student achievement data presentation, and the partnership with NIET. First off, RHS synchronous instruction. For three weeks, RHS building was closed due to a water leak that uh, required extensive repair to the schools and classrooms. The team from R RHS has worked for many years to get to the point where synchronous virtual environment was effective and successful yet there still is no substitute for live in-person experience. Thank you to our partners in Boys and Girls Club and Morrison Reeves Library in making this a successful uh, experience for the kids. And then Brent Baker uh, presented K through 12 student achievement data. This data showed some improvement from the first testing that was done at the beginning of the year there is still much work to be done, and many of the schools did not see as much improvement as had hoped. And finally, Dr. Wright presented an overview of the RCS partnership with NIET. NIET is the National Institute for Excellence in Teaching. This organization builds ed educator excellence to give all students avenues for success. The story of Fairview was shared this evening. Fairview has seen the largest increase and in improvement in test scores since the beginning of the year using the NIET model for collaborative learning. Congratulations to the staff and educators at Fairview School. Again, this was the first meeting work session of the Richmond Community School Board. We will be working to get these meetings streamed and recorded for future viewing. Remember to keep up on the happenings of Richmond Community Schools. Please follow the Facebook page at wearerichmond.com and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you for your continued support of Richmond Community Schools. I'll see you next time.